Okay guys, what you're looking at is a bear's lime or a Persian lime. I had this plant for a few years. Uh, originally was in a pot and we would keep it inside in the winter and outside in the summer. We had it on our back balcony and it's just a really tough spot for it. But one of the problems with citrus is when you bring them inside you tend to get terrible scale. It's such a pain to clean off. So I kind of got sick of this plant getting covered in scale and you get sticky sap, uh, you know, on your floors and stuff. So I said to health it and I just left it outside. I've been leaving it outside and, and uh, it survives the winter. It looks rough, but um, it comes back. But, you know, this year I thought to health it. I'm sticking this thing in the ground. Uh, it wants to live so let's give it a shot so I moved it over here and I think the Sun kind of zapped it and fried off a lot of the leaves and so I kind of trimmed back um, what was dead and this plant has come back with a vengeance the leaves are probably the biggest I've ever seen them it's got big thorns <coughs> it's doing great so this is uh, south facing, there's gravel, the house is there, actually the house is on all three sides, uh, behind this boutique here is the garage, and the other thing is it has overhead protection, so I know that this particular spot does not get wet in the rain, it stays dry, and it is extremely fast draining soil. And with all the rocks and the cement in the house, this is uh, quite a warm spot. Even in win even in the winter, you come out here in a, a sunny day and it's quite warm. It gets sun first thing in the morning. So that's where I've stuck it. Um, these are supposed to be zone nine. We tend to have quite warm winters here. Uh, we are zone eight B, but rarely do we have a zone eight B winter, um, usually even like a 9B. I, I don't normally see below 25. Our days are above freezing. So I think this is going to do well here. So we'll see how it goes. Um, I planted this a couple years back. This is a South African aloe. Um, that's a zone 9 plant. And it has survived. Let's try and get out of that. Survived and flowered and grow so I kind of treat this as my indicator plant that has been here for a few years and done well so we'll see how the lime tree does and I'll keep you updated thanks for watching